Hello Aquarius, I hope you're all doing well. Welcome to Reading Self. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading and it will not resonate for everyone. Okay, for Aquarius, please, please spare a message for Aquarius love situation. For Aquarius, please. For Aquarius, please spare. <clears throat> okay. So at the bottom of the deck, we have the Seven of Wands. So someone here, uh, you know, it's like the runner-chaser dynamic where one person's the chaser, one person's the runner, okay? Someone could have pushed you away, but now wants to fight for this, okay? Could go vice versa. So there's definitely a runner and there's a chaser in this situation here, okay? So let's see for the present situation we have the seven of swords yeah someone could have pushed you away right and you know someone who was very sneaky here played a lot of mind games okay someone could have also done this pull you know push and pull type of energy right hot and cold type of energy they want you and then they would leave and they would come back and then you know once they went when they came back they would you know give it their all right sort of like love bombing and then you know they would turn cold and then would leave you hanging right so type of behavior here why is the seven of swords here the eight of cups okay you could have walked away right they could have walked away there was a walking away here though okay someone walked away you could have walked away because you were tired of this person's behavior, said no, it's enough, right? No more hot and cold, right? This is not what I want here, out of a connection. But they could have walked away towards another path here. Why is the Eight of Cups here? The Page of Swords. So, <laughs> there's that Page of Swords, right? Very sneaky, this Page of Swords. So what I'm getting here is that even though this person walked away, see, that's the thing. Even though this person walked away, you're still in their focus. They're, you're still in their focus here. You could have cut communication. You could have cut contact. You could have ghosted, okay, or, or them. But there's some spying going on here. There's still some spying. Some of them might want to break the silence. Some of them might want to open up if you're not in communication. If you are in communication, they're very sneaky. The Page of Swords is a very sneaky card here, okay? With their emotions, <clears throat> they're not truly telling you, right, everything. And so, yeah, could act all emotionless, detached, right? But this is definitely someone who has a focus on you here. Let's see for the blocker potential. The Hierophant. So there's potential for someone to... I mean, gain some wisdom, okay? To actually learn from their mistakes, right? Learn lessons here. Someone needs to learn a lesson, okay? And it could be with a Taurus. But there's like also could be potential for commitment here. Let's see for the Hierophant. Why is the Hierophant here? The Ace of Cups. There's a lot of potential here. Some walked away from an Ace of Cups here. There was an opportunity in the past, right, to um, start a new beginning in love with this person, but someone here was walked away from this, okay? Someone was not, uh, you could have given them, okay, unconditional love. You were ready for this Ace of Cups. This is what you wanted. You were open to it, okay? You were very loving. You're very giving. You're very generous, but this person was very sneaky, right? Your person was very selfish. It was a very selfish energy. They were more into themselves than to in this connection. You know, not very considerate of your feelings here. Why is the Ace of Cups here? Why is the Ace of Cups here? The Knight of Cups. Well, let me tell you, some walked away, but someone still has a lot of love for you. A lot of love. Someone wants to get back this Ace of Cups, and that's why they're spying here. Someone wants to approach you with a cup of love. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. They're trying to gain information about you. Maybe the long time has 
gone by since you've been with this person maybe you're not on good terms but whatever see whatever this person is telling you if you're on communication they're not coming across as a knight of cups this is how they truly feel that's the potential here but they might come across as a page of swords they're not telling you anything maybe they have a lot of ego they don't want to tell you that they're still hung up on you here and that they actually have a lot of love let's see for the recent past the eight of pentacles so i'm getting this as you right you putting in effort you know into this connection you were ready for the hyphen this commitment these you were ready for it okay but they were could have been very immature here emotionally detached emotionally immature sneaky right why is the eight of pentacles here why is the eight of pentacles the death card yeah i think there was an ending right because <clears throat> there was no reciprocity here right it, there was no equal give and take here so could we do with a scorpio why is the death card the knight of wands yeah someone was a player hot and cold in and out right wishy-washy non-committal here but there's still a lot i mean there's a lot of potential here though there's a lot of potential if someone would just you know do their work here learn their lesson there's actually a lot of potential so aries or sagittarius let's see for the focus for the focus the empress taurus libra so this is you here definitely so they're look how how they're seeing you right the empress they're seeing you as way above them right they're the seven of swords page of swords and you're like the empress the one who gave it all the one who put in that effort right so yeah they're seeing you in a very like very positive way they're admiring you from afar without page of swords they're, they, they feel maybe that you're not on the same level you're way up higher right why is the empress here the four of wands they want commitment here with you they actually want commitment right they want commit like i said right this person actually you know caught feelings for you maybe they were not expecting this they said oh i'm gonna walk away i'm gonna go away because this is what they did right in other connections they would walk away and that was that but then they met aquarius it's like well that's not the same thing aquarius was a very good to me right aquarius was you know giving me everything yeah definitely they see you know a lot of potential with you here and it's not like you know i could get away from aquarius and then that's it as in the other connections no it's in a very special way i think they see someone who's has like great values and great you know great morals here and it could have influenced it could have influenced your person to be a better person why is the four of wands here the eight of wands yeah they want to move right they definitely want to move towards you they're spying and all but they they, they the goal here right it's to move and it's to move towards you with love someone who's still actually has a lot of love someone who realized the grass wasn't greener on the other side let's see for the near future the six of swords there's movement again your person clearly wants to and they want to go from a seven of swords see how they're going to go towards a better conditions maybe healthier lifestyle right someone who feels like they don't want to be in this type of energy anymore right because they met the one now it's like okay i've met the one i've met aquarius it's time that i stop this type of behavior right because i mean it's like once in a lifetime opportunity right i'm not gonna get another empress here right and so maybe it's stringing your person to you know do some changes here so definitely they want to go from a seven of swords to a six of swords they want to go from you know from towards something that is negative to positive here and so this could be also someone who wants to travel towards you if you're at a distance so why is the six of swords here 
the magician they're actually manifesting you back so we have virgo gemini aries and scorpio so they're manifesting things going well they're manifest they're manifesting movement here action right why is the magician here the queen of pentacles they're manifesting you back this is the perfect partner yes right very good you come across very honest loyal the empress with the queen of pentacles wow they're seeing a very good way here this is someone who's very stable very good right marriage material here a good spouse yeah i i think it's like i think your person's realizing they're not gonna meet anybody else like you another it's like once in a while you know once in a lifetime type of opportunity and they could have realized well they i missed it and it's like they're you know and they want to get back now to you right let's see for the what you should know the two of swords so there was this stagnation confusion your person was not seeing things clearly at the time seven of swords toxicity so yeah and also there were definitely maybe not willing to see their own behavior as well right not making a decision whether or not being at a crossroads right so there could have been a lot of stagnation in this connection because someone here was not you know uh, confronting their issues okay confronting their behavior here but this is definitely someone who wants to end this with that six of swords eight of wands they want to end this so why is the two of swords here the strength or strength and courage here needed yeah a lot of self-control yeah your person's having a lot of self-control also so it could be that with the leo i don't know if i said that Strength is like overcoming inner doubt it's like no i know right that aquarius is the one for me i know okay and so there's no more inner doubt about it why is the strength card here why is the strength card the king of wands aries leo or sagittarius so they want to take action so someone here wants to stop holding back right <clears throat> and wants to take action wants to and the stagnation the confusion the king of wands like let's go for this right this is what i truly want clearly this is what they want it's in their focus their focus is to come towards you for commitment here because they're seeing you as the one as their empress they can't find anybody they're never going to find anybody else they they came to that conclusion that they will not find anybody else like you and they don't want to miss this opportunity if they missed it in the past they don't want to miss it now so king of wands is like confidence again so they're getting strength in king of wands that's definitely two cards of having this confidence right not just manifesting but also taking action so they're manifesting things going well but they're also manifesting confidence and and strength here right to be brave here enough to take action so let's see for the outcome for the outcome the king of swords so gemini libra or aquarius yeah this is someone here who i mean wants to definitely come towards you with integrity someone who could be more mature more serious now okay yeah this is how i see it the king of swords can come across as someone who's cold and detached yeah i don't think this is definitely someone who you know is truly expressing how they because it's in the potential here so they may not be truly using this potential to come you know towards you with love they'll come across maybe distant and cold right but deep down inside they actually have a lot of love for you so it's like you know they're coming at, across someone who actually wants to act with integrity though okay who wants to do the right thing who wants to make a decision who wants to there's a lot of determination also with the king of swords the king of swords has you know thought about it and knows what they want and what they don't want and now they seem to know pretty much it's in their focus what it is that they want okay they want to come towards you here why is the king of swords here 
the page of pentacles yeah they definitely see that opportunity with you now there's a message here for you it may be a peace offering because i do see that six of swords someone who might be a little bit shy because we have an empress here right it could be intimidated by you we have an empress and a king of Pan a queen of pentacles so they're gonna take baby steps towards you okay it could be a little bit and even like king of wands is intimidating king of wands has a lot of confidence but look they're, they're, they're manifesting strength and courage here to approach you because I think this person definitely feels that you are at a higher level, okay? But they see a lot of potential with you. Now, you know, the, the thing is, do you see potential with this person, right? So they're taking, I think they're being very careful how they're approaching you because they clearly they don't want to miss another opportunity. That's, I mean, definitely what I'm seeing here. Where's the Page of Pentacles? The King of Cups. So that's good, right? That's very good. This is actually someone who's opening up to you here. Their hearts, they're, they're really in their heart space now, which is very positive. So I think that it's actually good to have this balance, okay, between King of Swords and King of Cups. It's good to have this balance, someone who wants to, you know, who actually has thought a lot about it, okay? And knows what they want now, but also wants to, you know, show you love and, and you know, be open to you emotionally here. So I think your person's in a very good, going to be in a very good balanced place here, okay? The mind and the heart. And so, but yet still being because they want to be very careful very careful how they approach you yeah they're definitely it's like someone who's testing the waters here with you and wanting to take baby steps so there's definitely going to be communication a peace offering here with the page of pentacles this is someone who might want to make commands with you okay and so it's up to you okay aquarius if you really want them back if you see potential with them so that's it so i hope it resonated with you i hope you enjoyed the reading take care bye